Hi friends, today we will learn how you can use joystick module with Arduino to control DC motors which is mostly used in making robotic car. This is a dual axis module in which you get X axis and Y axis along with a push down button which works when you press down the knob from the top. To make this project I am going to use joystick module, motor driver module, two DC motors, one LiPo battery, Arduino Uno and some jumper wires. To run DC motor with Arduino we need some driver. I am using L298N driver module. I am connecting the first motor with first output connector and the other motor with the second connector. In this module, there are six input pins which control the direction and speed of the motor. Now our motors are connected. Let's connect the module with Arduino using some jumper wires. In this module, we have enable A, input 1, input 2, input 3, input 4 and enable B pins which we will connect with the digital pin number 10, 9, 8, 7, 6 and 5 of Arduino. I have included its connection diagram in my article so that you can make the connections easily and correctly. You will get its link in the description. Now I am going to connect the joystick module with Arduino. Connect the ground and 5V pin of this module with ground and 5V pins of the Arduino. VRX and VRY pin which is for X and Y axis, connect them with analog pin number 0 and 1 of Arduino. And there is a switch pin which I am going to connect to the digital pin number 8. To run the motors, power is required for which I am using LiPo battery. But any DC power supply can work fine if you choose it according to the voltage of selected motor and driver. At last, I am going to connect power connector of the driver module of my 7.5V LiPo battery. Almost all the connections are done except one. Whenever you connect the driver module with any external power source, as we are using LiPo battery for power supply and Arduino with USB cable to get the power, then the most considerable thing is to connect the Arduino's ground pin with the ground pin of external source. Otherwise, motors could not work properly. Now it's time to upload the program. For that, after connecting the Arduino with USB, select your board and port from tools. Then click upload button. Now the program is uploaded. Let's see whether it is working or not. Look, it is working perfectly fine. I can control its speed. I can rotate it backward and forward and even control left and right motors separately which will enable my robotic car to move left or right. You can get all the related links in the description box below like Arduino program, connection diagram, L298N driver module where I explained in detail how this driver module works and the function of each pin and connector. And you can also find the link from where you can buy the related items, Arduino, joystick, jumper wires, etc. You can simply click the link and purchase the items. If you are new to our channel, then please subscribe and press the notification bell so that you will get notified whenever we upload a new video. Hope you liked the video. See you again here at Circuit Magic YouTube channel. Bye for now.